I want you all to step up and speak out. Um, no matter how you identify, whether you identify as the partner of a trans person or a trans person, whether or not you identify as any kind of trans person or no kind of trans person at all. I, I want you to think about the voice you have and use it. Use it however. Talk to Congress, but if you don't feel like doing that, if you don't think you'll be amazing at that, talk to your school or your workplace or your children. Just keep talking. Let people get to know us. We're already at the place where people want to know us and they want to know about us. And, and more and more people come up and they say, you're a transgender, I know a transgender person, and they're happy to meet one. And, and yeah, that's kind of creepy and, <laughs> and, and, and crazy, but, but in some sort of creepy and crazy way, that's, that's progress. Well, I, I was speaking to a youth group in St. Louis, and I asked people, how are things changing? Are things getting better around here? And this, this um, high school kid said, he said, three years ago I came out, everybody bullied me, and there were these three guys in particular, and they beat me up all the time, and it was just horrible. And um, now, three years later, it's a lot better. I don't know what happened, but they're my friends. One of them came out, and I, I just don't know what happened in our town. You know, it was him that happened. He's the one who made that happen. He just came out. He just had voice. He gave himself voice, and he said to everybody, look, I'm, I'm gay, you know, I'm here, deal with it. We can be amazing. We can have voice. We can win everything that is ours, everything that we deserve, and everything that our families need. So let's do it. Have voice. Kick ass. And thank you all so much for being here.